Hey yo, what is up everybody? It has been a little, it's been a little while, huh? On, all right, now this is weird. I, f I feel like I'm out of shape. Like I haven't been to the gym or something like that. It's, it's, I'm trying to get back into recording shape, all right? So what we have here is the worldwide campaign info. Hitman, why are you recording this video? Bro, we've known what's happening, what's been happening, what's going on for the part one for like 15 hours at the moment of me recording this, not even uploading it. Bro, I'm out of shape. <laughs> all right. So what I'm gonna do is this is kind of like a test run. All right. This is demo mode just to show you guys. I'm I'm working my way back into the mix just in the nick of time. Hopefully for me to be able to make content for you guys all throughout this celebration. My technical difficulty started, you know, two thirds of the way through the anniversary. So I'm I'm back though. I'm back. No, I haven't given my thoughts. Right. Like you guys don't know exactly how I feel about a lot of this stuff. And this is a very very different celebration so top to bottom i want to go through a lot of this there's a lot here there's no shortage of of work to do for every single player now cooler and goku i first of all i have been wanting to say this on video for weeks i love that this is cooler and he's going to be a dokkan fest exclusive i could care less that his brother was last year's celebration i could care less that namek goku might get replaced depending on how this celebration goes how good this new goku is but Either way, the new Goku is not a Dokkan Fest LR. You guys know that by now. He's a Carnival exclusive. We're going to have to see what that banner means. But like I said, let's work our way down. Login bonus, worldwide missions. By the way, if my audio or anything sounds weird, just know I'm listening back to my own videos. I'm trying to figure it out. All my settings in OBS, they're gone, man. They're, they're just gone. They're gone. They're wiped. I don't have any of the old stuff. So I'm just going to have to figure it out over the course of the next couple of weeks to master where I was at before. I'm going off memory and, and IQ. That's all I got. So bear with me. All right. I'm trying. I, I miss doing this and I got to get back into the mix. Now, this Dokkan Fest slash like Dokkan Fest X, you know, legendary summon carnival. This is a, a dope idea right i mean you don't have two dokkan fest exclusives so you the thing about these rarities you know you don't want to water down that, that's all they have left until they come up with something new which is somewhat this goku here having units that are dokkan fest lrs and then we get to the point where there's 30 40 50 of them even though that will take a couple more years you don't want to reach that point too fast we don't need two dokkan fest lrs every time it's an anniversary or a worldwide campaign i am not surprised by this decision tanabata introduces a dokkan fest lr also right like so you guys get where i'm coming from you automatically have at least five a year i like the fact this new summon carnival thing is a legendary carnival is it's like a new rarity, but they didn't have to introduce a new rarity. It's a new tier, a new caliber of unit. He's going to be exclusive to these banners, I assume. Like, he's only going to pop up two, three times a year. So that is another way to make him coveted, right? I mean, I assume these, this, I assume Goku and Cooler are going to be on the same tier of, like, unit. Like, they're both going to be top five. So I like the fact that both of them will have their own... I don't know, mark on the game or something like that. Like it is, and you know, a lot of the times, I don't know if people have noticed this, but whenever they're doing something new, think about it. The very first LR was <laughs> was a Super Saiyan Goku. I like the fact that, you know, we're, we're circled back around. The very first legendary summon carnival LR is gonna be a Super Saiyan Goku. And I just, I know it doesn't matter. That's just how I look at the game. All right, let me have this. All right. No, like I said, this is just dope. All right. I I'm hyped for Cooler. I'm very hyped for Cooler. I wanted Cooler to get an LR for very, very long. Just a final form Cooler LR. That's dope. We've seen their arts with the SSR. This is their SSRs, of course. The TUR arts are cool. The SSR or the L Oh my gosh. I really haven't been recording. The LR arts are cold as hell. I like them both. I got to see them animated first, though. We've only seen like the screenshots, right? confrontation packs apparently these aren't on jp yeah jp wins enough let us have this but now i'm just playing i do think they should be on both versions seriously new cooler or new stage of a dokkan event of course the final form cooler event the summon tickets so we're gonna work the work our way through these missions throughout the entirety of the campaign then we'll be able to do a guaranteed lr multi there's also a stone version of this i have not done it yet i'm thinking i might do it on stream or maybe i'll just record like a three four minute video doing that i don't know yet my thing don't summon on it yet 
if you have the 200 stones, I would suggest and advocate for not summoning for it yet. I know we, I usually am the guy at least that says like, go all out. Like, you know, you see these guaranteed LR thing, these step ups, whatever it is, go all out. Guaranteed LRs. You got to take advantage of it. Let's just wait. I want to see what Goku's banner format will look like. Because Goku's banner has seven LRs featured on it. We got to see what those LRs are. Cooler, of course, will have a no normal Dokkan Fest banner. Sort of like what you saw for... No, no I shouldn't even say Tanabata. Oh, when's the last time they released a Dokkan Fest LR that was not a Tanabata unit, but they were by themselves? I guess it's Gohan and Goten. Everybody else is coming up here, right? Okay, that wasn't Tanabata. So the last singular LR released that was a Dokkan Fest LR was Gohan and Goten, I think. So think of it like that. Cooler's Banner will not be a Tanabata type thing with a whole bunch of units on it. It'll be more like that second Tanabata banner with the Goku and Vegeta on it. You guys kind of, you guys know what I mean. You know, I hope it's not too confusing. So I expect both their banners to be decent. Goku's could easily be better. Like for all we know, they slap a uh, AGL Golden Freeze on there and like Gohan and Trunks or, I don't know. There's a Janemba, who knows, bro. We'll figure it out once we see the banners drop. At the time of this recording, the information should drop about 30 hours from when i upload this so this up this video should be uploaded about 30 hours from then i don't know how to do the math for you i'm telling y'all i haven't recorded in a while all right so i'm trying to say this stuff in a professional manner and i'm my thoughts are jumbled up so let's, let's keep going cooler's new stage the missions the co-op campaign is cool uh the, remember to do this every day just click on the twitter button like on the microphone and then just cancel. You don't have to actually post anything. Please don't post any. We don't want to see that all over our timeline. We're not worried about that. So yeah, just make sure you do that every day. The Duel Dokkan Fest, like the worldwide campaign banner. You know, that banner is cool. I don't need anything off that. That's more for newer players. I mean, I don't have everything rainbowed, right? But I, the only thing, the units I don't have at all are STR Videl, AGL Kid Gohan, STR Super Vegeta, and STR Bojack. Those are the only four. I'm pretty, maybe I'm missing one unit. But I'm, those are the only four I can't get my hands on. So I'm probably going to buy AGL Kid Gohan with my Memorial Stones. I got 165 Memorial Stones. I am... I didn't realize I had spent that many stones in the past. Like, I know that seems like a small amount compared to, like, truth or something. But for me, that's way more than I typically get. Especially now that I'm a full-blown, like, YouTuber, right? So, well, not full-blown, but you know what I'm saying. So, progressing YouTuber. Let's put it like that. Progressing YouTuber. I got more stones than I'm used to the past two years. I might be a gambling addict. I know, I know that doesn't sound like that big of a statement for a Doe Connor, but I might be a gambling addict. I, I might be easing my way into it. <laughs> Who knows, man? I got to do the math on how many stones that really is that makes up that difference. Now, Worldwide Campaign, 50 Special Summon, Memorial, the Redstone. The Redstone is different this year. STL Gogeta is already awakened. He comes in a pack with, like, you know, Broly. Him and Janemba both have packs, you know, this wrathful Broly's in there, Namek Goku's in there, there's other units in there. I don't think that that means you should just get them. Like, let's be honest, Gogeta's pack is mid, Janemba's pack is mid. The only thing that would fix their packs is this guy right here. I've wanted this for since last year, actually. If this guy were to easy A, that would be very good. But he's a Super Saiyan Goku, so it's like he still wouldn't even be able to beat Namek Goku. Much less, you know, the new carnival Goku that's on his way. Movie hero Goku. We need to find... Is, are we calling him Bird Ku? What are we calling him? Are we calling him Bird Ku? I'm okay with that. Bird Goku, all right? Purple Stone. Uh, if you're a whale, you know, take advantage of that. You know what to do with your own money. I can't tell you what to do with that. Don't worry about that if you're free to play, of course. Dragon Stone Sale. I got to get into that. I need to go grab gift cards and stuff like that so I can get to working. The new story event, the Gohan Goku unit is terrible. The cooler unit is mid. I, they clearly are going to EZA. They always EZA. But I don't even see potential for the Gohan unit. Like, I really don't think that they're going to be good. I think they're still going to be trash, which is very sad. Because for players who, like, enjoy... They're not just being free to play. Like, if you're free to play, by all means, bro, you, you should be complaining anyway. But even if you like using free-to-play units, like, I like free-to-play units because they're usually more creative or they have distinct roles. When they're mid 
and you don't see a future for them, and then they easy A, and they're just a slightly better mid that really hurts the game, in my opinion. Like, it's like you don't even inspire the players that are dedicated to grinding up units to like, feel inspired, right? It just, it, it sucks. They don't feel motivated to care about these units outside getting the tickets for the, the banner up here, right? For the 50 unit banner. So it's just dumb to me. But him, the cooler and the Goku Gohan will easy A in part two or part three or whatever. The Gohan event is crazy. We get this every year now. I love that they keep giving it out. Every seven days, you'll get 30 stones by doing the event. Dope. Uh, the limited event for movie hero and movie boss category skill orbs. That's dope. I got a gold orb on my first run for like three, three, three additional. That was, you know, <laughs> W's. The new red zone stage. There's a glitch on coolers. Cooler is not supering on global. Like, not like, oh, he's taking forever to do it. Cooler does not super. I fought Cooler all three times since the event dropped. This is the same day. That, so I've done all three of my possible runs so far since the event release. Cooler does not super. He hits hella hard. Like, Cooler was, was whacking me. Ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Cooler, Cooler might have smacked me with his dick the first two times. So <laughs> I was kind of forced to do three runs. And then the third run, I took him seriously. And he was, he was still doing decent damage. But, like, type advantage doesn't mean much to this Cooler. Even on his normals, he was doing, like, 30, 40, 50K on these normals. He, if you didn't have enough defense, he's doing like 110k to units that are type advantage over him. He was doing a lot. Don't be type neutral. Cooler is he's not playing with you. So yeah, even without his super attack effect, of course, makes it significantly easier. I imagine JP players are a lot of them did not beat it in the first three attempts, but I'm just speaking from my side of the game. No, red zone GT missions, that's dope. I plan on doing those soon. So complete missions to get a certain Complete a certain mission to get to complete the support member. Oh, no, no, that's just the old mission. Okay, so they added the missions to and SSR guaranteed tickets to the GT Red Zone. I'm sure the movie boss one will get that mission set in part two. We'll see what they do. Boss Rush, I already did that. This challenge event is one of the few things that we simply don't know about yet. New high difficulty event. I think it's going to be harder than, you know... Hmm, I think it's going to be harder than Infinite Dragon Ball History, but easier. Like, okay, let me say harder than the God event, but easier than the Red Zone. I think it'll be somewhere in that middle section, the gray area. We'll see what they do. By all means, if it's the hardest event in the game after you drop Cell, after you had dropped the new Red Zone, and then you drop this version of the Red Zone, Global is getting a lot of high difficulty content in a very short amount of time. <laughs> nah, that's crazy elder kai's battlefield the keys are coming to global i am super hype about this i can't wait so i'm lit for that supreme kai the mission like that's the actual event Namek goku's easy -ing. i hope you guys are link leveling him at least get him to like sevens and eights before he he easy a's so i'm ready for that full power freezer i hate str lr full power frieza i have him rainbowed on jp and i'm not happy about it but at least now i get to go i'm gonna go awaken him to lr make sure he's link leveled at least a little bit and then we'll go from there but trust me he's one of like i hate str lr trunks in my i hate frieza about 70 percent as much as i do them so yeah i know if you keep up with the channel you know what that means i despise frieza no Cooler, the tech cooler should be getting his sub easy a another character can be easy a so he's getting his sub easy a i hope he's decent but he of course can't do anything with the new dokkan fest lr we'll we'll see we'll see hopefully he has viability on you know a different i don't know sbr or something like that reward boost from three to five would love to see that and the rest restoration time is shortened the five hour difference like when it's cut down three hours is insane i feel it i feel it and I, I keep logging into the game and my boosts are already back at like three or four like that week where it was at the end of the anniversary the ex i felt it so i appreciate when they do that hidden potential zenny campaigns returning campaigns all the etc i think that's the dokkan scout make sure you guys if you guys really want to get that done and you have the i think you just need a pc make sure you do this the the bot like there's a bot you can use it's not a dangerous bot as far as I've never heard anybody say anything happened to me after using this bot specifically, 
uh, I, I don't want to say who gave it out, but he is very helpful. So if you guys want to know, just tell me in the comment section and I'll type it. I'll give you a link to the post he said he makes. I appreciate him and all the et cetera. All right. We got all that here. So it is the kid hit, man. Like I said, I'm out of shape, so I needed to get back in my reporting mode, man. It's the kid. I miss you guys. I hope I was missed. I do. Thank you so much for your time. Regardless, man, Hitman is off this.